Today we'll be taking a look at the GoPower Pure Sine Wave Inverter with Transfer Switch. Now, an inverter is an important thing to have on your RV since it's going to make our DC power from our batteries usable for our AC appliances, things like our computer, microwave oven, some lights, and other stuff. Pretty much anything that you would plug into a normal house outlet is going to be run off of AC power or that alternating current. Now, this being a pure sine wave inverter means that it's going to have a very low harmonic distortion and has cleaner power like your utility supplied electricity. Basically, it's just going to be very, very similar to what you would typically get out of that, that power coming into your house. And that also means that it's going to have, it's going to make our appliances run quieter, faster, and cooler than a modified sine wave inverter. We'll have on the side all our connections to make there. We'll have our two large terminals to connect to our battery. We'll have our two AC inputs and then all our other input inputs, including our switch to turn it on and off or to turn it over to remote power. And then on the other side, we'll have our fans. You want to make sure that you install this with about an, at least an inch of space in between the unit and any wall or obstruction because you want to give that those fans room to do their thing. We'll also get our large ring lugs to go on our connections back here. Now this will run 1500 watts of power from the battery. You can use a solar controller to turn it on and off. It's going to be pretty lightweight you can see I can lift it pretty easily just with my hands here, and it is compatible with 12 volt systems. It has a nice low profile design. As far as dimensions, it's 13 and 7 eighths inches long by 11 and a quarter inches wide, and that's going to the outside flanges. If we just measure the unit without those flanges, it's closer to about 10 inches. The height is five and a sixteenth tall, going from where it sits on the on the floor here to this top ridge. And you also want to make sure that you install this in the horizontal position. It's not really designed to go vertical. As far as our other specs for this, it does have again continuous output power of fifteen thousand or fifteen hundred watts. Surge power is twenty four hundred watts. Our AC output voltage is 100 volts, 110, 115, and 120. Input voltage range is between 10 volts and 16 volts DC. Our AC output waveform is again that pure sine wave, and it has a maximum, maximum efficiency of 88%. The battery drain with no AC load is less than or equal to 0.9 amps. There's also a low battery alarm and a low battery shutdown whenever it gets too low. And this does come with a two-year warranty from GoPower. Now you will want to pick up the remote for the GoPower industrial for our uh, inverter here. That's available separately. You can find that here at eTrailer.com using part number 342. 79999 and then the installation kit for our inverters also sold separately. That part number is 342GPDCKIT3 and that's going to have the cables to connect this up to your battery and to your other um, linkages. And that's going to do it for our look at the GoPower Pure Sine Wave Inverter with Transfer Switch.